Mr. Lagwin from Lucas Indian Service. How are you, sir? I'm good, thank you. How are you? I'm doing good, sir. Thank you, sir. So, first question, sir. Uh, with Lok Sabha elections around the corner, how are sentiments in the CV industry right now? No, I don't think uh, the elections have anything to do with the CV industry sentiment. It is about the supply and demand, and I'm sure uh, through the course of the year, it will definitely pick up. Okay, sir. So, how is business at Lucas Indian Service and, and been for you at the start of 2024? I think 2024 has started well for us and I hope this year will be a good year for us. So, the Indian CV industry is going through a massive technology transformation right now. How is your company adapting and contributing to the same from a tech perspective? Well, the tech which is changing in commercial vehicles are in the emission side, which is on the fuel injection side. We are already there, we are already working with uh, most of the OEs and uh, therefore, I would say as the technology evolves, we will also evolve along with it. The industry is a bit slow right now due to the elections. What are, how would you see the performance to the rest of the year and what are the main growth drivers be? I think it is, I'm, I wouldn't say the slowdown is because of elections, there could be various other reasons that are and Indian economy is after all connected to the global economy, so I am not seeing election being the reason for any specific slowdown. I am very confident that during the course of the year, the industry will definitely pick up because a lot of infrastructure projects which are going on and there is a fair amount of industrial production which has increased in the last quarter and there would be transportation needs and then the uh, Public transportation is improving as well in many states and I'm, I'm sure there will be a uh, there will be good demand for buses, uh, both heavy commercial and light commercial vehicles. Awesome, sir. So, final question. What are your future growth targets for the rest of 2024? Well, we definitely would like to grow beating the uh, inflation in double digits. So, keeping my fingers crossed about that. <laughs>